Uh, Green sees things in waves. I wrote, I wrote this poem uh, a number of years ago when I was working with homeless veterans. Uh, uh, it sounds almost incredible, but I, I was uh, I was doing uh, workshops with um, uh, these poor beleaguered guys, and uh, the last thing on earth they wanted to do was write poetry. But when I told them that they could write poems full full of uh, hatred and disgust and uh, all those sorts of things. They perked right up uh, because they uh, had all sorts of things they were angry about. And one of the fellows was named Green, and he told a story one day about having taken too much LSD some years before when people did that sort of thing in North Beach. And uh, uh, it, uh, it it took so much LSD, it created a, a, a sort of a neurological trauma. I wouldn't know how better to put it. And uh, he might have been telling me a story, I don't know, but it was a good story. And here it is. Green sees things in waves. Green first thing each day sees waves. The chair, armoire, overhead fixtures, you name it, waves. Which, you might say, things really are. But Green just lies there a while, breathing long, slow breaths, in and out, through his mouth, like he was maybe seasick. Until in an hour or so, the waves simmer down and then the trails and colors off of things. That all quiets down as well, and Green starts to think of washing up, breakfast even, with everything still moving around, colors, trails, and sounds from the street and plumbing next door, vibrating. Of course, you might say that's what sound really is after all, vibrations. But Green... He's not thinking physics at this stage. Mm -mm. Our boy's only trying to get himself out of bed, get a grip. But sometimes, and this is the kicker, another party, shall we say, is in the room with Green, and Green knows this other party, and they do not get along, which understates it quite a bit. Quite a bit, and Green knows that this other cat is an hallucination, right? But these two have a routine that goes way back, and Green starts hollering, throwing stuff until he's all shook up, whole day gone to hell. Bummer. Anyhow, the docs are having a look. See if they can't dream up a cocktail. But seems our boy ate quite a pile of acid one time. Clinical. Wow. Enough juice for half a block. Go, 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 little greeny. Blew the wiring out from behind his headlights, and now, no matter what, can't find the knob to turn off the show.